What's up guys, Professor Oak here. Been dueling up at the main academy gate. I wanna to talk to you guys a little bit. Commentary, narrate, my duel, whatever you wanna call it. My duels, uh, plural, there's more than one. But anyways, uh, some of the things I'm noticing here are, I wanna get better at this game, so I watch my clips back, try really hard to make skillful plays, try to use equipment that I think is uh, very good and strong and will uh, win me games but at the same time is not carrying me to win those games I have to still put in the work I got my ass parried just then trying to use the uh, gargoyles twin blade as a weapon when it is mostly just a L2 stick uh, same with this claymore I'm gonna boss out one thing that I have uh, really grown with gotten better at is weapon hard swapping but a thing that I'm still struggling with is not uh, the act of hard swapping my rings which I can do it is the act of remembering to hard swap my rings if I had taken just like one more step forward I would have gotten that charged R2 a running R2 probably would have been even better of a choice but say lovey uh, hmm thought I was gonna go for a backstab there still pretty big damage yeah, this is one of the better duels. I still think that, uh, you know, someone that really was trying their hardest may not have ran 50 feet away to try to do some spells, but punished for their efforts regardless, and that's a GG. Oh yeah, this is, uh, this is actually, I don't know if I should spoil it, we'll wait till the end. This is, this is fun. This guy had a couple buffs he used, interesting stuff, you know. But somehow that just, you know, no vigor. Vigor check, that's what I wanted to say. A lot of people, they, they don't seem to want to level their vigor. I, I don't understand the obsession with the more casual players and the decision that they do not want to have uh, health points. I don't understand. I also have noticed a lot of the more casual players, they like really, really enjoy jumping attacks. This is a pretty good duel right there. That was uh, straight up combo linked like it was a fighting game. I pressed square to throw the firebomb knowing he would roll it and pressed R1 immediately as if it was the next chain in a combo sequence. I was very proud of myself for that. Everyone pat me on the back, tell me I'm a special boy. Thank you. Bike Spear. This is my least favorite thing to fight in the game. I'd rather fight Rivers. I'd rather fight uh, a shitty Bloodhound Step user if like you're badass at the game and use Bloodhound Step. May maybe that'd be worse, but like uh, I'd rather fight a shitty BHS user easily. And the fact that this guy's a mage too makes it a uh, obvious like uh, Ent Faith build, right? So uh, what happens in a second will make more sense because I was convinced, you know, Ent Faith can't work in PvP. It's too much stat investment. And right now you're gonna see that I'm correct. Watch the first R1. Here we go. Any minute now. Come on, Professor Oak. We can hit this guy. I think I was still in the mood of trying to embarrass him. He avoids that too? Let's see. How long did it take me to hit this guy? Am I honestly trying? There we go. 724 damage is, you know, what, 85% of his health? So that's how he got the end faith build. But yeah. Lots of people like this. Main Academy Gate is not uh, very fertile grounds for good duels right now. And then people will tell me, well, the Discord, go go fight in the Discord. Yeah, well, they have banned so much shit that, like, I, I don't want to have to uh, check five spreadsheets to see if, uh, you know, one of my ideas is wrong. More power to them doing that, but, like, I just want to play the game. I don't want to have to get on an external app, you know, but is what it is. Oh, and Caster, if you've played on PS4, you have to have played Caster. He's there like every day, puts his sign down in almost the same spot, comes out and uses almost the same spells every time. I got him that time. I, I risked a lot trying that Ash of War in the middle of like the casting, and I was panic rolling a little bit. It got squirrely, but I got him. How are you guys doing at Main Academy Gate? Are you guys encountering the, the the same breed, the same sort of folk? I want to invade more, I do, but uh, a lot of the invasions, or rather I should say, a lot of the invasion spots seem to be 
dried the uh, the fuck out, as they say. I don't know who they is in that context. I don't know who says that. Just madness, like madness, you know. The madness, it's madness. It's mad how mad the madness can really make you mad. But he is dead. This is Bloodhound step. I feel like this is the Bloodhound step clip. No, not this one. Okay, dual great swords was done. Oh, okay, there it is. There it is. Almost, almost gave you some credit, man. But yeah, a lot of this. Now, what's encouraging this? I know if people are like me, and you know, you look up YouTube, you want to uh, be good at the game, so you look up some people who are good at the game. You're seeing, uh, you know, Chase, the bro, right? Uh, he doesn't really use these things. Or maybe you would see, like, G9. G9 doesn't have as big of a following, but he's up there too. Maybe you would see G9, and he doesn't use these things. So, like, Stilovsky, I know that he uses, like, the veteran set and stuff, and, like, maybe he'll use the crouch poke, but he doesn't, like, bloodhound stuff or anything too, uh, crazy like that. I don't, I don't know where these people get, uh, I, I would hate to give them the credit for being original, you know? I mean, it's not original, it's given to you from the story mode of the game, like, on the direct path, things like Rivers of Blood, and, but it's just so, what is the reward for them? I'm not complaining. I love it. I love to uh, get easy wins from people who aren't playing the game as optimally as they could be, so I'm not going to complain. But it is just funny to think where, wh who is their hero? Who's the guy that made this look cool? But, Ice Spear. I really suggest that if you don't have a. Uh, uh, caster of any sort, like if you have no faith or intelligence to be throwing anything. Thunderbolt and Ice Spear and Flame of the Red Mans are three of the best Ashes of War just to make up for your lack of ranged options. And then, like, I've used several times the Aromatics and the Thunderbolt Bombs. Thunderbolt Pots, rather. Sheesh! They will save your ass so many times against people who want to just run across Main Academy Gate and spam things at you. Oh, not me just shitting on a dual seppuku occult fucking, uh, peeler, huh? No, not that. It's all doable, guys. We got we got the counters. We got the skills to counter these people. Uh, when somebody good gets this in their hands, scary. But we got this, guys. Thanks for watching.